Hey guys, Pioneer Agronomist Tony Zeruzan here. Wanted to take a minute and talk about early planted soybeans and the yield response. Early planted soybeans has been a topic question asked by many growers all winter long. In a study done by Pioneer in 2017, a trend was observed on on-farm soybean plots that showed a decline in 0.24 bushels per acre per day from the earliest planting dates. Similar trends have been observed in recent studies done by the University of Illinois, where a three-year study showed significant yield benefit to planting early in central and northern Illinois. Soybean phenological development is well known to be influenced by day length. Shorter day lengths will speed up progression throughout growth stages, while longer day lengths may extend development. This physiological component is important for understanding why a soybean crop is responsive to early planting. A study represented in this figure showed that mid-April planting allowed soybeans to begin flowering before the summer solstice, when the days are still getting longer. Now, not only did early planting allow soybeans to take advantage of longer days, it also extended the period of the reproductive growth. 52 days to reach R6 growth stage compared to just 37 when the soybeans were planted in mid-May. The reduction in the length of reproductive development will later limit the amount of photosynthate that can be produced and allocated when setting pods. Remember that photosynthate production from R1 to R5 is the primary driver for soybean yield. Now certainly good management, favorable conditions, and sunny days during pod set can help result in high photosynthate production and in yields, but there's no other way to lengthen a reproductive period than by manipulating the planting date. So please take that into consideration when you're getting out there with your planters. Thank you and stay safe. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.